if you are a Bobby Shmurda fan, there is finally some good news for you that you will not believe. Bobby Shmurda is finally being released. He is getting let go early for reasons we will tell you today. So make sure you watch this video until the end because you will not want to miss what we have to show you. Also, if you are a Bobby fan, leave a like on this video, watch until the end. And if you do want to enter this month's giveaway of some Dre Beats brand new pair, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and comment free Bobby and you will be entered in the giveaway. Now, for those who don't know, Bobby Shmurda was an internet sensation. He's a rapper that went completely viral after he dropped his song Hot Boy. The song went crazy. People were doing dances to it, making memes out of it, copying the dance and making videos all day. The song was completely viral internet sensation played non-stop by everybody which gave Bobby Shmurda his name and a lot of his fan base and soon after he was signed to a multi-album seven figure deal by Epic Records so he made it he made it in the game but sadly he was one of those rappers that could not stay out of trouble could not just live with his success and be good and take a straight path he literally put his career on the line he has been gone for a long time he's had some other good songs drop besides hot boy but he has been gone for a long time and has not had much music lately if you didn't know he was a part of the gang gs9 Obviously, when you're a part of gangs, you're going to be in trouble regardless of who you're with or what you're doing. When you're involved in gangs, there's always some illegal activity going on. And that is what got him in trouble when he was charged with weapon possession, illegal weapon possession. And he was sent to prison. And after spending over a year and a half in jail awaiting trial... He finally pleaded guilty to conspiracy and weapons possession in a deal with prosecutors three days before jury selection was to start. The judge basically asked him if it was true that he possessed a loaded 9mm handgun. He did reply, yes, your honor. And he was arrested outside of the, record, the recording studio in December 2014 in Manhattan. And he was accused of being a leader in GS9, or also it's called G-Stone Crips. They're a violent street gang in East Flatbush, Brooklyn. The police are saying have been responsible for one murder and several other shootings, which definitely does not help his case in any type of way when you're facing trial and you are involved in that kind of gang activity. You kind of lose all credibility or any chance of the court being on your side and having any type of mercy which is one reason why he failed to make bail. And after all this happened, he started speaking out about what he thought was a lack of support from, in his words, a corporation that had profited from his gangster image and what he's done. And he has been interviewed in jail. And he basically, in his own words, said, when I got locked up, I thought that they were going to come for me, but they never came. He said that he had no help from his label, and he went through three different defense lawyers. All of them failed to get him his $2 million bail reduced. His music career obviously went down the drain, not completely because a lot of fans still rock with him and a lot of people still love his music, even though he hasn't been putting out a lot lately because he has been locked up. But he's been accused of doing other illegal stuff and it's just been piling up on him. And putting it all together, that is why he decided to take a seven year plea deal in a gang case. Which means he would serve seven years, which is a very long time. Luckily for him, he has had a lot of fans that have still been like asking about him and still talking about him. He still seems to be... A popular rapper even though he hasn't been in the game for so many years he was even in a song recently with 6ix9ine where he made a verse behind bars and obviously when he's been in prison this whole time I'm sure that he has a lot a lot of tracks that he's been writing down he has a lot of plans for when he comes out and he could come out and make the spotlight which actually seems to be happening quicker than we would think he does seem to be getting released earlier than his seven-year plea deal which was said that the plea agreement meant that his client would be free within five years. Assuming that he behaved the entire time he was in prison, there have been some incidences that, that may mark his freedom and could potentially cause problems. But overall, I don't see that happening. And his mom has said 
After he hinted that he would be home in 2020, his mom has said that she expects her son to be released by the holiday season of 2020. She thinks in November. She even made an Instagram post a while back saying 25 more months and I can kiss your face again. So it does seem like he's going to be released fairly, fairly soon. He was originally arrested in December 2014 and he was sentenced in 2016, but they are using those two years almost two years that he was sitting in prison as time towards his total sentence, which means he has already served all of that. Plus, he's been in there for about four extra years now, and he will be up for parole in December 2020 after a successful August hearing. Since he is being credited with two years time served, his tab of violations during his incarceration, like I said, could cause a few problems, but if everything goes well, he will be released in 2020, which is coming up very, very shortly, and a lot of you will have your favorite rapper back, and who knows what kind of success and what kind of tracks he's going to drop when he comes out or where he's going to take his career. It's actually going to be exciting to see. With that, I am going to end the video here. If you are a Bobby Shmurda fan, like this video. If you do want to enter the giveaway, leave a comment. And also, if you are new to the channel, please subscribe and I will see you in the next one.